Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. So let's jump into today's message. Whoever I'm speaking to, you guys get people excited. You get them pumped up. You get them feeling euphoric. You guys are a walking love spell. People are falling in love with your level of happiness and they want to commit to that. So there's people that are definitely wanting to ride your wave. You guys are feeling really creative right now. And there's some people that are a little bit bothered by it, but you are learning how to master it all. So you guys should be really proud of yourself. You guys are stepping it up. There were people that were trying to make you feel bad for standing up for yourself, for speaking up, and you're shutting it down. You're not falling for lies, for gaslighting, for anything that's deceptive because you are learning how to trust your intuition. So a big thank you to Purple Garden for sponsoring today's video. So you guys, like you don't even know, like you can choose from hundreds of advisors. Like what do you need? Like Purple Garden's got you. Do you need a tarot advisor? Do you need astrology? Do you need oracle guidance? Like what is it that you need? So what I love is they have an introductory video that you can watch to see like, hey, do I feel their vibe? Am I a vibrational match to this person? I only wanna share things with you guys that I'm extremely passionate about that's going to make your life better and give you the clarity that you need. All you guys have to do is create an account and you'll be able to choose from hundreds of advisors that are online right now. Is he or she thinking about you? What is next for your love life? Want to know how to make your relationships stronger? Purple Garden has an advisor ready for you. No sugar coating, just the clarity you need to make a decision that's right for you. Purple Garden even offers palm readings, angel insights, oracle guidance, and dream analysis. You can choose whatever advisor best suits your needs and you're able to connect with them via text chat, phone call, or video call. So my personal experience with Purple Garden, like my first one was like so nerve wracking. I was like, who do I choose? Oh my gosh, there's so many options. And I was just like so excited. I felt like a kid in a candy shop. I'm like, oh my gosh, there's so many options. I was like, you get a heart, you get a heart, you get a heart, you get a heart. So then I saw, I came across Tabitha. And I loved her red hair and I was just like, I have to know more. And I have a friend named Tabitha, so I was very interested to watch her video. And I just liked that, even though her hair was like very vibrant, her introductory video was very like down to earth and I felt like I vibed with her, where I felt like I wasn't gonna get any sugar coating and we were gonna get straight to the point. So when I did my first reading with her, she got right in. You guys know that I've been trying to stay zero contact with my family, especially my mother. There's a lot of trauma and darkness there. I hadn't even gotten my question out. Like I had like three questions I was gonna ask and I hadn't even gotten it out. We got the hello and she was like, okay, I need to tell you this. Like your angels want you to know who you're trying to open the door to, that's a no. And that was like crazy for me to hear. It's like my angels know that I have such a big heart, but they also know that there are people around me that are relentless, that are dependent on my forgiveness. You cannot open this door. You cannot leave it cracked because it will just be opening that wound over and over and over again. And like, this is all before I asked her the first questions. So I was like, wait, what? <laughs> So I was just blown away and I felt really comfortable and I felt like things were getting answered without even me even saying anything. So I just feel like you guys are really going to enjoy digging deeper into the things that you want to know and the peace and the clarity that you need in your heart. So from that, I just know that I am making the right decision. Like I am doing the right thing by being zero contact because for a little while I'm like, maybe I'm being too harsh. Maybe I'm trying to be like, you know, real like, I'm fine, but no, my angels were like, no, we're very proud of you for that decision. Keep that door shut. I was like, okay. All you guys have to do is go to the link in the description box, it's at the top, and also at the top of the comments, and you guys can get the clarity that you need to live the fulfilling life that you guys deserve. As a new Purple Garden customer, you will get your first deposit of $10 unmatched using my promo code, Brittany. So just thank you guys for sitting through that and a big thank you to Purple Garden for sponsoring today's video. So I'm so excited to jump into today's message for you guys. What I wrote down is you make people feel desired. You get people pumped up. 
You are the walking love spell. You were chosen for this industry. So don't apologize. Okay, you were chosen for this industry, so don't apologize. People immediately fall in love with you. You guys got people breaking their necks and falling all over the place to see what you're doing. Then we have, there's people always trying to get closer and closer and closer to you. Boundaries are definitely an issue when you guys are dealing with people. So you're learning how to amp, amp those up. Then you guys have a very small percentage of people that are triggered when they're listening to you or when you're just doing your thing. Okay, so you guys, what I'm getting is keep being yourself. There are some people that are gonna wanna hold on to the old version of you. Most people are gonna conform to this new wave of your happiness. But what I'm getting is you are meant to be an inspiration. You are meant to be influencing wherever you go because you're just like magical. You're like sun walking sunshine. I love it. I'm here for it. So let's see what else we get for you guys. If you guys have headphones in, make sure you guys turn down the volume. Okay, let's see what else is going on. I'm seeing that you guys are a messenger of some kind. Definitely a healer. You guys are being very creative. You are feeling like your imagination is being sparked right now. But Spirit just wants to remind you that like people are enjoying this new campaign that you're on to celebrate your happiness to celebrate your creativity. You're taking off a mask of thinking like, oh, I gotta do it this way or gotta do it that way because that's what people will accept. You guys are walking away from that. You are moving away from self-sabotage. I love it. You guys could be, you guys could be an earth sign or you guys could be a fire sign. Okay, you don't have to be, but that's what I'm getting. You guys are really focused on healing so it's like you guys don't want to pump fake people you don't want to be like this person that has a false mask on and then people are like oh my gosh they're not really this person you guys don't ever want that to ever be you you guys are realizing what you are meant to create and how you were meant to create that you guys are tapping into your cosmic blueprint you are learning how to focus on your skills your talents your gifts, your abilities. So let's see. I'm gonna pull out this deck. I'm seeing that you guys are very artistic. You're going through, uh, sorry. I'm seeing that you guys are very artistic and you are going through a giant transformation. Like physical, on a soul level. You are very... I was going to say mysterious and then it popped out. Oh my gosh. I was just about to say like, because I'm looking at this card. I'm like, you guys are moving real mysterious right now, which is good because you guys are having to protect yourself because people are falling for you. Like they just immediately fall for you and you see that. So you're learning how to move more mysterious. You're learning how to like, just not share just any old thing. Free spirit fell on the ground. Um, you guys have a lot of wisdom. And there's people that maybe necessarily feel triggered by you thinking that you're a free spirit. Keep doing you. Do not apologize when you know that you have pure intention. You guys have pure intention. Surrender your ego. Don't do any over explaining for whoever this is. Okay. Some people are going to try to act like, oh, I'm here. I'm here through it all. I'm your biggest fan. Or I've been your biggest support. And you guys are learning how to better trust your intuition. You guys are gaining a lot of clarity right now by amping up your boundaries, moving very mysteriously. You guys could be moving so you guys could get more privacy. And I'm just seeing that you guys are not sharing a lot of details about your life as you guys go viral. You guys are going viral. You guys are getting a lot of recognition. You're getting a lot of attention. So I'm getting that there's like some people that are like, oh my gosh, I've known you the whole time. Da, 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 da. You guys got some people that are asking you for money. I'm seeing a lot of like energy vampire. Shots fired is what fell on the ground. I'm seeing that you guys have a lot of energy vampires around you. A lot of people that want to bring you problems. This is why you guys are moving. 
You're either moving a different way or actually physically moving. But what I'm seeing is you have this new air of mystery. You guys could wear your hair really big and people are like, oh, it's like Mean Girls. It's like your hair is full of secrets because you're just not telling people what you're doing and you realize that you are the walking love spell. It's like you got to use your vibe responsibly, okay? Because people get, get crazy. See, I'm getting that the divine chose you. The divine chose you for this industry. Do not apologize for your creativity. Do not apologize for going viral. You guys maybe had a rough upbringing where your dreams were always being stomped on. Your creations were always being stomped on. You felt like you were always in scarcity because you guys definitely have still, uh, you guys definitely have some people around you that want to make you feel like there's not enough for you to have all of the viralness. Like there's not enough for you to have all of the magic too. So uh, somebody's trying to bring some type of shame to your willpower. No. Comment down below. My willpower is here to stay. My creativity is here to stay. I am releasing a poverty mindset. I am surrendering my ego. I am moving mysteriously. These could be sisters, okay, or family members that have always been giving you a hard time. Spirit wants to keep reminding you. You have pure intentions. Don't let anybody try to tell you anything different, okay? You guys have pure intentions. Shame is at the bottom of the deck. Self-love is upside down. Like, sometimes you guys feel bad when you show yourself a lot of love. When you guys level up, it's like you guys feel bad. Are people going to think? It's almost like you're wondering if people are going to think that you're stuck up or that you sold out or that like you're all mainstream now. And Spirit is saying, release that. Release that doubt. Release that fear. Every level you heal, you are meant to be an inspiration. So you guys, drop your butterflies down below because you are meant to enjoy this growth. You are meant to enjoy this transformation. Because your beauty is shifting. Your life is shifting. You're mentally and physically shifting. Your beauty is shifting from the inside out. So like one of the anthems for this channel is we vibrate high. Okay, we vibrate high, high as heaven. We stay prayed up and strapped in every sense of the word. Our destiny is ours by birthright. Don't start none, won't be none. There are people that have not accepted the boundaries, the level of respect that needs to come in. There are people that haven't accepted how things need to be. You guys have a new beginning that you're getting ready to approach, that you're getting ready to walk through. You guys are jumping timelines and you guys got people upset. They're like, oh, wait, oh, wait, oh, wait for me. Or they're like, oh, wait, oh, wait, you can't go there. That's the wrong way. Switch on your inner light. Bring forward your gifts. You are meant to share your gifts with the world. You are unlocking something that was once locked to you, okay? And we have the cosmic pearl. Expand your psychic gifts. Open the gate to the angelic realms. So comment down below. I am protected. I am divinely protected. I am switching on my inner light. I am expanding my psychic gifts. I am trusting my inner knowing. Your inner knowing is, is everything to you right now. So be open to abundance. Trust your inner knowing. Because people really want you to doubt that right now. You guys could be 21 years old, 34 years old, 25. You guys could be going through your Saturn's return. Or it could have just ended. And now you're ready to move forward. You guys were going through some heavy Saturn lessons. And you're like, I'm out of here. It's time to move forward. You just feel like a, a big weight has been lifted off of your shoulders. Yes, you're ready to heal. You're ready to grow. You're ready to expand. I love it. You're going to be feeling 
really supported right now. Comment down below. The lion moves for no one. Magic is all around me. I am the spiritual warrior. Spirit is saying, show that you are a wise leader. Command the universe. Show that you are a wise leader. Command the universe. You are the lion. You are the unicorn. You are one of a kind. People are trying to act like, oh my gosh, Susie or Michael, which is always a collective, they're a lion. And you're really like a lamb. You have pure intentions, but people are trying to make you feel like you don't have pure intentions, but you were born leader. Rest in perfect love. You are in a cocoon of white light, divinely protected every day of the week. Then we have light. You guys are a lighthouse to others. I love it. You guys have a lot of high vibrational energy that is around you. You guys could really resonate with mermaids, sirens, fairies, lions, unicorns, butterflies, rainbows. You guys are learning how to choose happiness. People are always going to have something to say. But you guys are learning how to choose happiness. Let's see if we get any tea. Oh, we got on time. If you guys are working a nine to five, you guys could have been dealing with somebody that was trying to get you fired from a job and they were going around lying about you. They were on some type of smear campaign. I'm sensing that justice is coming through for that and they've been trying for a long time and they've been wasting their time. Um, I'm also getting that some people that were trying to smear your name in the workplace, they're having like issues in their personal life right now. Okay, so they're all having like personal emergencies where they're being called away from being able to keep smearing you. And then we have financial issues. Okay, so this is what's coming through for the people that have been lying on your name. They're having to deal with their own issues, the, their own stuff that's on their side of the street. Okay, so... All the drama that they were trying... Sorry, my hair is like stuck. All the drama that they were trying to cause you, that's not working anymore, okay? Because now the drama is on their side of the street. So people are looking at what's going on in their life. Like, oh, you were doing all of this chasing and talking and, and craziness and you had all of these things going, in, going on under your own roof. You should have been focused on that. There are going to be some higher ups that have had enough of this person's either their drama, their lying, their fake news, the things that they stir up. Um, I'm also getting that somebody here is really good at somebody that you're dealing with that lies a lot. They're really good at lying to different people and getting what they want, lying to different people to get what they want. People are starting to figure it out. Um, I feel like you've been waiting for this person to get some type of justice for a long time. And this is a prediction. You already know that this person loves attention. Okay. And this person's always uh, treating you a certain way because they have a lot of jealousy towards you. Okay. This person's very jealous about the attention that you get. Because they want all of the attention for themselves. But yeah, what I'm getting is people are starting to see through them and they just lie all the time. They, they will lie, they will finesse, they will concoct, they will make things up to get whatever they want. But they also are not acquainted with your spiritual rank. And as you guys level up, I don't know what they think is going to happen, but it's just going to be a no. Yeah, we got kiss my to all the haters. It's like, why are you so obsessed with me? They are so obsessed with you. And I love how Mariah Carey always has butterflies on. So there's a butterfly on her ring. It's like, you're just transforming. They cannot handle it. And this is either like your family dynamic, your social group, your friend circle, whoever you're walking away from in life, they know that you're better than the situation that you're dealing with. And you don't like being around these people because they deep down can make you feel confused or like you don't like it. The energy that they bring, they waste a lot of time. 
they bring a lot of negativity into your life. I feel like they're just constantly attacking people, like belittling people, making them feel less than. And like you're trying things that are new in your life. And everyone else that's putting up with that, I mean, may they find their blessings. But, like, you guys are definitely outgrowing this situation. Yeah, I'm getting this is it. You guys are graduating from this lesson. Of thinking that you need this job or thinking that you need this group of friends or thinking that you need this money from, like, or this source of income. Is there anything else? I'm getting that you guys are putting yourself back together. And, yeah, you guys are done worrying about these people. So you're going to break up or cut them off or quit or put in your resignation or put in your notice. Dang. Yeah, you're about to give all of these people the finger because you're tired of going round after round after round after round with them. They're always, it's like you get a level of quietness, then they want to make you worry about your career again. And then it's like, they always want to go another round. They always want to make you feel like you're on the verge of getting fired and you're so over it. You are so over it. And you're like, I don't know what they think this is, but I'm not on the verge of getting fired. Because again, you were chosen for this industry. Period. The end. These people are not acquainted with the facts. They've been trying to steal money from you. They've been trying to steal opportunities from you. They've been trying to steal attention from you. They've been trying to make it look like you stole money. And it's like, no, do not feel bad for you guys getting people amped up, getting people excited, making people feel desired. You get people pumped and you were chosen for this industry, whatever industry you're about to tap into and even the one that you're probably leaving, you're meant for many different industries. And there's so much that you guys are mastering right now. Don't let anyone take you guys off. Don't let anyone take you off of the cloud that you are riding. Okay. You guys are going to be high off life on cloud nine. It's like you're this beautiful fairy and they want to like come through and like clip one of your wings. It's like, no. So they want your sweatpants. They want your promotion. They want what's in your bank account. They want your little dog too. It's your power that they want. Wizard of Oz. You guys know what time it is. You guys have had enough. You guys have had enough. You guys are so done with fake people. You guys are so over it. You guys are so done with the people that lie. And they're, these people are getting put in their place. Even if they act like they're not. Okay, that's something that somebody needs to hear. Even if they act like they're not, somebody is addressing the fact that they don't know how to leave you alone. So you guys could have been at this job for a long time, or you guys could have known these people for a long time, and you're learning how to surrender to what the divine has in store for you. Okay, let's get you guys out a royal message. Be your own first priority. This is this makes a lot of people mad, but do it for you. Be your own first priority. Then we have every hurricane comes to an end. Then we have the world awaits you. So comment down below. I'm slowing down to enjoy this feast. Not everyone will have a seat at the table. Every hurricane comes to an end. I am my own first priority. The world awaits me. Period. You guys, justice is coming. And you're about to be... Justice is coming. It's like Game of Thrones. Winter is coming. Winter is coming. No, justice is coming. And it's here. So you guys are... Learning how to make certain changes, even though they're hard. Even though they're hard. This is what you guys are learning right now, is to make certain changes and for your own benefit. You guys could be cutting your hair. You guys could be changing your hair color. Nine of Pentacles. You guys, you're going to have multiple streams of income no matter what. 
Because what did I tell you? You guys were chosen for many industries, many streams. Anything else? We have the Queen of Wands. You guys are building confidence. Even though people are trying to put impossible expectations on you, you're starting to stand up for yourself. You guys got some real nosy, intrusive people and you're learning to choose happiness. You know that justice will come. You're going to plan accordingly. You're going to move accordingly. And can't nobody tell you nothing. You guys are learning how to give and you're learning how to receive. You're learning how to not be too generous with the wrong people. You guys are carrying the sword of truth. So comment down below. I am the Galactic Truth Serum every day of the week. Like you're not backing down from your truth, from your authenticity. Anything else, spirit? Like you're going to start rocking the crown that you deserve. You deserve multiple streams of income. You deserve to eat good for all the good that you do. You deserve to have nice things if that's what you want, if that's what you desire. Keep doing you. It's not going to stop this train. Never, never, never. So some people are going to be disappointed, but that's okay. You're going to choose you. You're going to choose to walk away. You're going to choose the high road, okay? You're learning where things are worth it and where they're not, okay? And you guys are also learning that you have this desire to do things your way and that's how you're going to go viral. That's how you're going to help others. That's how you're going to create your legacy. That's how you're going to create residual income. Money while you sleep. So comment down below. I make thousands daily. I will be the first millionaire in my family. Anything that I spend comes back times 10, times 50, times 100. I am ready for this rebirth. I'm, you guys are moving away from the... Uh, you guys are stepping away from confusion. This is your glow up. I also feel like Archangel Michael protects you guys. I feel like your ancestors are very proud of you for the work that you've been putting in. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, let's see. Let's get you guys one more message out. Where are we on time? Let's get one more message. And then we're going to get you guys an angel number. It's taking a lot of courage to do the things that you guys are doing. So don't let anyone try to make you feel some type of way. Because they're going to try. Okay? We have light and love. Your purpose is to bring divine healing, light, and love to this world. Your purpose is to bring divine healing, love, and light to this world. Wow. You're becoming more sensitive and need to make changes accordingly. So you guys are feeling out the situation. Like you're catching a vibe. You're like, okay, this does not fit. I, you know what you're outgrowing. You can sense it. You can feel it. I love it. Let's get you guys an angel number. Okay, we got three, one, six. Angel number three, one, six. If this is synchronistic to you guys in any way, let me know. I feel like we just got this number, but let me know down in the comments if we just got this in another video or in another uh, message. So we have 316. This could be somebody's birth date or it could just mean something to you um, personally. You guys can drop the definition if you'd like, but don't forget to let me know what's going on in the comments. I love reading your guys' confirmations. Don't forget to drop your favorite affirmation, affirm what you wanna bring in for you. Don't forget to smash the, you know what, hit the bell, duh. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.